hey guys and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new my name is Michaela and I am a third grade teacher and today is the first official day back at school so today it's gonna be mixed with like PD and then I think a little bit of work in my room so if you're seeing this video I got to work in my room so um, it is 734 I don't know why I said it like that I was gonna say 735 anyways it's 734 and I'm about to leave my house. This is like the most presentable I've looked in probably five months, so. So it, we're in our classrooms for like the first time. Um, this morning it's like 11 or 1040 and we had like a lunch or I mean a breakfast in the cafeteria and did like a rundown of just some stuff, some numbers and stuff. And then we got a new person on our team, so we just met as a grade level down in the grade chairs room. This is my room. I brought this huge thing. This is stuff that I brought home um, at the beginning of like virtual learning or whatever. So I need to unload that. My room still looks a hot mess. I'm trying to like think through some things. I also had a coffee slush, so I'm like. <laughs> don't really know my thought process is velcro maybe i have one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirty forty fifteen fifteen and i'm thinking maybe like a little i don't know if they'll kick it right here maybe i can put them right here and everybody have their folders and stuff in that or maybe on the floor like that i don't know um I don't know if you guys have like watched me um, in the past, but they have, they're gonna have science books and they're gonna have go math books. And I let me see if I have one in here because I wanna show you guys how thick they are because that plays a role in it. So this is how thick their go math book is, which was the problem last year with using these because, I mean, if you put the go math book and the science book in there, that's it, that's all they can put in there. So I'm thinking maybe I keep the go math books and just tear out pages as we go because a lot of stuff is still gonna be online. Um, I don't know, I have no idea. So if you have any um, advice on that, I still have these white cubes. I want to put them somewhere today that's not right there. Um, some people are using like crate seats or stuff. I have truly no idea. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna try to figure some stuff out. I really haven't done all that much shopping or going to like Dollar Tree or stuff. And so I've been seeing stuff on Instagram. So yeah, I think also the only people who are gonna put their backpacks on these racks are gonna be these people and my people in stools because obviously they can't put a backpack on their back of the chair, but I think everybody else may. I don't know if it was up to me i honestly don't know that we would have backpacks this year just because that's more fabric coming into the building more uh, like germs and stuff but anyways no one asked me <laughs> um so i am going to store it i like don't even know what to do can you guys tell i've had like three cups of coffee slush okay gotta go All right, I just literally made just another mess, but I'm clearing this out. I just have too many containers for it to not be completely organized like I like it. So I have like birthday stuff. Um, don't really know how Skittles are gonna work this year. You guys know that I like use them as like a little happy, like if they answered a question or something, I would just let them pick out of a jar, but clearly that's not gonna work this year. I've got like so much glue and just like stuff. If I end up making math boxes, I'm gonna put because we do have enough for everyone to get one. So this is headphones from some of my kids last year. I'm gonna put this over here just so it's out if they come back at the beginning of this year. And then I just like had all of these extra. So like I said, I have too much storage for it to not look very pretty and neat. So I'm going to get started on that. This is what it looks like so far. 
I don't remember where I got these labels from quite honestly I think I got them from teachers pay teachers and then I just like put um, whatever font I had in my word and then printed them out I think this is a kg blank space maybe that's typically my go-to font um, so this looks nice I need um, a few more of them um, but I don't like how that looks but that's fine that's all the birthday stuff um, I have that cleared out that cleared out this needs to look better but I have Ziploc bags tissues all that good stuff that's just supplies from last year and then over here I'm trying to condense some stuff um, I've got some math manipulatives that I'm still trying to figure out I don't have enough for each person so um, this is kind of just uh, miscellaneous stuff um, because of the fire hazard um, I know some people had asked why I didn't have um, like shades on those but it's apparently a fire hazard so I took those off I have random stockings left over from Christmas some leftover multiplication cards and then those are the clock manipulatives I have um, this is so I used to let them pass this around for reading obviously that is like so dermy at this point in time so we're not going to use this but it's a really fun microphone that I will probably use um, and then some cotton swabs and some cubes left over. Um, here's another miscellaneous bin that I'm just trying to get condensed. And we are not hurting for pencils whatsoever. So these are all the pencils we have. Like half of them are sharpened. Um, so yeah, we have so many um, pencils. So, but yeah, so I'm just going to finish up um, condensing all this stuff. I still have some artsy stuff in about 10 minutes we are going to meet as a grade level with our principal she's gonna what is that hair doing okay okay i like don't even know which way it goes anyways um we are going to meet over some logistics stuff i think i'm gonna hot glue this up at some point i like have a list of like little things i want to get done but oh i don't think i told you guys um which I haven't because I haven't picked up the camera since then. Last week they announced that our school is starting back a week later. So instead of starting back August 10th, um, the kids are starting on August 17th. That gives the teachers uh, a whole nother week of PD. So it may not seem like I'm doing like too much in the classroom because I'm not, but we are going to have more than likely enough, more than enough time to, um, do that so also we decided that uh we are going to have one virtual teacher and we already decided who it was so i'm not going to be doing virtual teacher unless something happens in my group of kids that i brick and mortar with if they if we all have to go home for some reason or quarantine or something then i would do virtual but besides that we do have a virtual teacher for third grade so I know that there were some questions about that too. So I am going to put this down. I've been listening to Taylor Swift's new folklore album. If you like the folklore album, let me know. But um, yeah, so just trying to get my classroom like super duper organized because it drives me nuts. I'm so type A. So like this nonsense right here is driving me bonkers. I feel like everywhere there's just like stuff. So I need to get that figured out. <laughs> okay. So we just got done with a meeting with the principal and a meeting with our tech lady trying to figure out all the new stuff. And I think that after being in someone else's room, I've come to the realization that I am gonna move my teacher setup. I won't be able to use these, but really the only one that's not decorative is that bottom one. And I'm going to move it over here because I think I would have more, I'll have more room backwards than I will wide if that makes sense i hope this is gonna make sense so like right now this is my classroom and i'm only able to get three rows and like losing train of thought slash getting really overwhelmed and having to take breaks but really quickly i will show you how beautiful this looks now i'm so excited that i got this organized and everything has a place um yeah so uh, this will come out because these are my light bulbs. I told you I stored them. I have my anchor chart, uh, Sharpie markers, birthday stuff, pencils, all that good stuff. Um, and then this being extra supplies. So, but back to what I was saying, I am going to move my teacher area over here. Now, I don't know exactly what that's going to look like, um, but it's going to happen. But right now it's 2.30 
and we're gonna leave it like three so i honestly don't know how much it's gonna get finished i may just like turn their desk around i don't really know i have honestly little to no idea so one of our lovely lovely subs that we adore so much she made masks for the teachers and like brought up a huge bag of them and so i got this pattern and they're all reversible so pink in this pattern there's a floral one and then there's this one so i need to get her something for that because that was super sweet of her to make sure that we had stuff but um yeah i guess i will just see what all i get finished this is definitely going to take more than today so yeah okay so i don't know if i said this so i'm just gonna do it this is how it would look if i faced everything that way and i had some of my team teachers come in and they don't like it like this so i'm going to keep it facing this way so how it originally was if i need to i was just worried about space so if i need to push those out a little bit more i will um i'm trying to like declutter this uh oh hold on i'm trying to like declutter all of this but um i got that hung up i got that hot glued up for their um their headphones so that's a little teacher hack if you have headphones they all get their own slip and they're up here they don't get wired and tangled and everything um so, but i do want to put my uh hold on i do want to put my kidney table facing that way so okay so nothing changed nothing happened i am going to leave now it's three o'clock and I'm going to go and get some stuff. I'm going to be doing a giveaway on my channel, so be sure to subscribe. Make sure the notifications are on, all that good stuff. So I'm going to get some of the stuff for the giveaway so I can make that video. Um, but yeah, I will check back in with you guys. Probably film tomorrow, which will be Thursday the 31st. Don't know. 30th? Don't know. But I love you guys.